Namaste, 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 Namaste. Namaste, Namaste. This is Namaste, 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 Namaste. Namaste, 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 Namaste. This is the voice. Namaste, Namaste. This is the voice of Suzanne. I'm Susan, your teacher and guide, known as Suzanne. Zenity is my term for sanity by Zen. And there's not much more sane than you realizing you are actually your own Buddha. Your mind can open up to awareness of what is true in your life just for you. Zen, or living daily with contemplation and meditation, is constantly changing. It has a spirit of its own that has been travelling for uh, two and a half thousand, let's say two and a half thousand years. But we know of Zen teachings four thousand years ago as a way to a peaceful and joyful life. It has not only survived but thrived and for a very simple reason. Accepting life simply and exactly as it is here and now. Sometimes we don't know what we want until we get it. On the other hand, there are times when we don't know what we don't want until we've got it. Believe you me, I know that to be true. So, in order to be okay and not be disappointed all the time, we make the best of whatever we have. And... um, I'll be a bit Yorkshire here, drawing back on my upbringing. This can feel like a cop-out. As if we're just making do with a situation that really is unsatisfactory. But this is not just a way, uh, a strategy, as in not an art. Uh, In Zen we say a way is an art, a strategy to cope. No, it's not. This is how we thrive. Your happiness lies in being able to appreciate all the very different aspects of your life and yourself, the whole of who you are. Namaste, or Gasho. I honour the spirit of the universe that dwells within you. So Namaste, or Gasho, whichever word suits you, it means the same. Suzanne. Namaste, 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 Namaste. Namaste, Namaste.